it's chips. I want some. Jeffy, do not eat chips on this couch. Why? You don't like Mexicans? What? You said, don't eat them goddamn Mexican chips on my couch. I didn't say that. I said, don't eat the chips on the couch. Ha, 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 ha. You're getting crumbs. Jeffy, clean up these crumbs. <laughs> clean up the crumbs, Jeffy. All right, Danny. What? Don't, don't sweep them on me. Stop it. Stop sweeping on me. There's someone at the door. Baby, help him. Hello? Hey there! What, the cops! What are you doing here? Are you the owner of this house? Yes. <laughs> no, you're not. Okay, fine. I pay a mortgage to the bank, so the bank owns it. Nope, they don't own it either. Well, then who owns it? <laughs> I actually came here to tell you that. Well, if you knew I wasn't the owner, why would you ask me if I was the owner? I like knowing things you don't. Well, then tell me who owns it. This is more of a sit-down-inside kind of conversation, so can I come in? Well, you could just tell me right now. Look, there's bugs out here, and I don't like bugs, especially the flying ones. Eek! I saw one. Okay, come inside, but I have to call Goodman. He's the guy who owns the bank, and I have to tell him whatever you're going to tell him. Okay, as long as I can get away from these bugs. Marvin, what the hell am I doing at your house? And why are the cops here? Well, the cops are saying that your bank doesn't own this house. Like, fuck it doesn't. We're the lien holder for your property. Well, sir, I regret to inform you that nuh-uh. What? Yeah, nuh-uh. Your bank doesn't actually own this place. You see, this house was originally purchased by Lee Harvey Oswald, the man who assassinated John F. Kennedy. What? Well, you see, back in the 60s, Lee Harvey Oswald actually bought this house, and he registered it under a business called I'm Gonna Shoot the President Incorporated. But then after he died, nobody realized he owned this house. So for years, the house just sat here with no living in it until eventually your bank bought it. But you see, the problem is they didn't have the right to do that because he didn't say yes. I don't believe this. That could easily be Photoshop. Oh, no, no, no. There's no way this is Photoshop. This photo was taken by the realtor. You know, I actually heard that he practiced shooting out of this very window. What? There's no way this is real. You're making this up. Hmm. Well, can I see your bookshelf? What? Yeah, I can prove this if I can see your bookshelf. Uh, okay, yeah, it's over here. I did your bookshelf. <coughs> mm, sorry, something in my throat. Is this your bookshelf? Yeah, here it is, but why do you need the bookshelf? Well, according to Lee Harvey Oswald's diary, he liked to keep his crayon drawings on the top shelf of his bookcase. So I'm just gonna check over here and see if there's anything suspicious. Hmm, hello, what's this? Killing presidents for dummies. Oh, that's gotta be his. Oh, let's just take a look. What is this? What? Yep, this has gotta be his drawing. Look, there he is, shooting JFK. Too bad we didn't find this back in the 60s. We could have stopped him. Oh, look, and there's the guy in the grassy knoll. Some guy named Kyle. Hmm, that's interesting. Okay, fine, I believe you. This house belonged to Lee Harvey Oswald. Yep, told you. Read it and weep. What the hell is that? This is Lee Harvey Oswald's own crayon drawing. This was his plan. It proves that Lee Harvey Oswald owned this house. Look, I don't give a shit. Just tell me how much I have to pay so I can buy the house. Oh, well, that's not really up to me. That's up to the mayor. Well, then get the mayor down here. I want to buy the house so I can keep making Marvin's life a living hell. Okay, I'll get the mayor. Okay, here's the mayor, Tuna Fish Terry. Yeah, yeah, thank you. Yeah, so listen, Mayor, this very wealthy gentleman wants to buy this house, but he wants to know how much the state wants for it. Okay, if you can tell me what the hell he just said, I'll let you have the house. Dance till you drop. Oh, okay, I think I just heard him say dance till you drop, so I think what he means by that is that he wants you guys to have a dance marathon, and whoever can dance the longest without stopping can keep the house. Listen, I don't want to do no dancing. I just want to pay money for the damn house. Well, it's not my fault, sir. It's up to the mayor, so we're going to need an officiator. I'm going to go get one. Look, Marvin, Jeffy cleaned up the mess all by himself. Come on, good boy. You really cleaned this up all by yourself? Yeah. Well, he helped. He watched. I saw the whole thing. Mommy did a great job. Jeffy, you were supposed to clean up. You're the one that made the mess. She's a woman! Who's at the door, Marvin? It was the police. The cops? What's wrong? Jeffy, stop! Ow! Room! Room! Go to room! <sighs> Listen to me when I talk- oh. Look, the cops are at the door, and so they said that no one owns this house. So they're going to have a dance competition. And whoever wins the dance competition, by being the last person to dance, wins. What? Marvin, we have to win that competition. We can't lose this house. I know. If we win the competition, then that means we don't owe Goodman any house payments. Hold on, Danny. I can dance. I'll throw down on them hoes. Jeffy, save your energy. Look, there's three of us, and we're only going, I don't know who we're going up against. There, there can't be anyone else that knows about this. So look, one of us needs to win, so we own this house, and we don't owe any house payments. Come on. Okay. Hello, and welcome to the Dance Till You Drop Dance Marathon. The last person dancing wins this house. We will start shortly. What are you doing here? Oh, hey, Marvin. I told my wife about the dance marathon. She wants your house. I love how big it is. 
That's the first time I've heard her say that. Well, don't try to win my house! I'm oh, sorry, Marvin. It's a nice house. I think I want it, too. I'm gonna dance my ass off. <sighs> I don't like this wall. I can't see the kitchen. Well, we can tear it down and put a stripper pole for your nasty ass. You can get naked while you're making me waffles. Oh, Tyrone, you and your fantasies. No one's gonna be tearing down any walls in my house. Yes, we will. When we win this house, we will. I'm a very good dancer. I know the cha-cha slide. Yeah, my baby can dance. Slide to the left. Ooh. Take it back now, y'all. Hey, what hot this time? Cha-cha real smooth. Oh yeah. My baby got rhythm. White girl rhythm. That means she doesn't have none at all. <sighs> hey! Hey! Mm. Get out of my house! I'm here. Oh no, you can't be here. Leave! I'm part of the competition. What? It's electric. Boogie woogie woogie. Oh, God damn it! Does the telescope come with the house if we win? I think I see Mars. All I see is red. That's my face. Oh, crap! Screwball, why are you trying to win my house? Hell is hot. This place has AC. Yeah, and I'm tired of sleeping in my van. Oh my god. Ugh. Okay, guys, it looks like we have some competition. But all we have to do is dance, right? Yes, but it's the last person left dancing, so we have to make sure that none of us get tired or give up because it's... Jeffy, put that back. I'm holding it. Okay, look, you just make sure that none of us give up, okay? Because other people are going to get tired, so as long as one of us is still dancing, we'll win the house, okay? Just damage the wall! Ugh. Come on guys, just keep your head in the game! Okay, I have the official boombox, so let's get started! Before we start, I want to go over the rules one more time. This is a dance marathon, so if you stop dancing, you are immediately disqualified. You must be dancing at all times. The last person dancing wins this house and everything in it. Now, if everyone's ready, go! Okay guys, dance! Marvin, what are you doing? This is called dancing. I got the moves. You're gonna hurt yourself. <sighs> no, I'm not. Marvin, I'm getting tired. It just started. You better keep dancing. Ugh. All right, I'm gonna go scope out the competition. Keep dancing. What? Goodman, you're trying to win the house. Of course I am, Marvin. I don't want you to be happy. I'm gonna take your house. You know what this dance is called? It's called the give me your house payment. See, I'm taking it. I'm taking it. I'm taking it. But you don't have it, so spanking time. Come on, try spanking dance. Ugh. 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 Wait, wait, why is Chives here? Well, in case I get tired, he can dance for me. Not to complain, sir, but I am 73, and I've had a hip replacement. Well, you're about to have a double hip replacement. You keep dancing those old tits. Very well, sir. Well, I'm not going to let you win. Honey, I don't know what to do. I thought they were going to play a song with instructions. I only know how to do the cha-cha slide, the cupid shuffle, the hokey pokey, and head, shoulders, knees, and toes. I know, baby. They tricked us. Look, we're going to have to improvise. Do what we do in the bedroom. But I got to get on my knees for that, and that only involves my mouth. So, guys, you want to give up? I heard this house has termites. We ain't scared of no termites, loser. Well, well, I also heard there's racist neighbors. Racist neighbors? I don't care about that. It ain't the first time I heard the N-word. <laughs> okay, well, just seeing what you thought about that. Ooh, Pointy, I think it's gotten bigger. That's my gun. Are you sure? I assure you it has not gotten bigger. I'm in my 40s. It's all downhill from here. So, you guys really want this house, huh? We're dancing, aren't we? Oh, well, I heard when it rains, the roof leaks. Then why are you dancing? I like leaky roofs. Pointy, do you want to dance to our wedding song? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Boiny, what are you doing? I, I'm dancing. Boiny, what was our song at our wedding? Well, it was Tub Thumping by Chumbawamba, obviously. Boiny, I can't believe you forgot our wedding song! No, I didn't forget, as long as it was Tub Thumping by Chumbawamba. <laughs> Is that a no on Chumbawamba? Uh, all right, we're out. I may get knocked down, but I get up again. <gasps> I just eliminated two people! Oh, yeah. All right, how you guys doing? Marvin, I got tired. I'm sorry. What, you gave up, oh, you bitch? What? I'm holding down the fort, daddy. Good job, Jeffy. I eliminated two people, so I'm gonna try to find a way to eliminate the rest of the competition. You do that, I'm doing the hop hop. Okay, I'm gonna put this Kool-Aid label on this ball of NyQuil so that people can drink it and fall asleep. I'm sorry, honey. I really thought our song was tub thumping by Chumbawamba. No, 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 wait, wait. <sighs> What are you still doing here? My wife says I can't come home. What are you doing? I'm about to put this Kool-Aid label on this ball of NyQuil so people drink it and fall asleep. That sounds illegal. Well, I'm not going to do what Bill Cosby did. Well, as long as you're not doing that, I guess it's fine. Oh, I'm getting tired. I wish I had an energy drink to drink. Oh, boy, do I have good news for you. I was just about to drink some titty milk. Titty milk? Yeah, it's one of the flavors from Gamersups. 
Is it good? Is it good? We're partnered with them. Of course they're good. This video is actually sponsored by them. It is? Yeah, it sure is. Well, how do I get some if I wanted some? Well, see, the way it works is samples are always free on the website, but customers usually have to pay shipping and handling. But with our code, it's completely free for the first 48 hours. So people anywhere in the world can try this product absolutely free with no credit card required. All they have to have is an email address and a physical shipping address. Oh, oh yeah, and there's all a limit of one per customer, because if they try to abuse it in order 100, they're not getting any. Okay. That's all that's awesome, I want some titty milk. Hey dang, I've had titty milk, it is delicious. Wait, you love the titty milk? Oh, I love it so much. What other flavors are there? Oh, there's also Guacamole Gamer Fart 9000. Okay, pour some of that for me. Okay, sure. I'm gonna take this and try to get people to go to sleep. Open the door to the gas station, baby. Now put a gun on the cashier, baby. Give us the money, bitch! Give us the money, bitch! Yeah, bitch, give us the money! Ooh, the cops coming, baby! Ooh, yeah, yeah, we gotta keep running, baby! Does anybody want any purple Kool-Aid? Hell yeah, homie, pass that shit! Yeah, you know that Kool-Aid, my weakness! Yeah, you better drink it! <laughs> okay, soon those two should be sleeping on the floor. Ooh, he's already knocked out too! We got another one! Oh wow, you guys just keep dancing, huh? Yeah, I can do this literally forever. I'm not human. Oh, well, you wanna play a game with Simon Says? Sure. Simon Says, quit dancing. Okay. Oh shit, you got me, how evil. I'm not stupid enough to fall for that. Hey, don't you have a warrant out for your arrest for trying to kidnap people? Oh, rats. Come on. Oh my God, that's two more people eliminated. Please, uh, I don't know how much longer I can, oh my heart. Sean's now having a heart attack, spanking! Please, sir, call an ambulance, I'm dying! Looks like your butler got eliminated. Marvin, if you think I'm giving this house up, you're crazy! Oh, well, I just had some gamer stuff to energy drink, so I can do this all night. Well, I don't even need sleep, I can do this all week! <sighs> okay, Jeffy, good news, there's four more people eliminated! But Marvin, there's two people asleep over there! <gasps> Jeffy, that means it's just me, you, and Goodman left. Okay, so I can stop? No, you can't fucking stop. Why would you stop, Jeffy? You told me that it was just me, you, and Goodman left. What? Well, that means I have to keep dancing. Well, you're the one who wants the house. Oh, my God. It was two versus one is better than one v one. God damn it. I'm going to win this. Well, Goodman, it looks like it's just me and you left. So how about we make a deal? Okay. I win. Looks like we have a winner, folks. Goodman wins the house. What? Hey, he cheated. He hit me in the face with a baseball bat. There were no rules other than just don't stop dancing. You literally could have killed someone and you wouldn't have been disqualified. Congratulations, you get the house. Thank you. Marvin, I'll see you next month for your house payment. Oh, this whole thing was pointless. Oh.